So imagine the makers of Genshin Impact made a space fantasy RPG. Well, you don't have to imagine because this video sponsor, Honkai Star Rail, has got you covered, man. This is a free cross-platform RPG available now on mobile and PC, and it's coming to PlayStation in Q4 2023. Your save data carries across all the different platforms, and in version 1.2, you're going to witness the epic climax and finale of the story on the Zianjo Loofu. You get to embark on a space adventure, explore different worlds with more than 20 playable characters, each with their own unique personality, backstory, and charm, with endless team building possibilities, with diverse enemies, environments, characters, and upgrades for a truly personalized strategy. Now, over 80 million people have already downloaded this game in less than three months since its launch. But it's not too late to get in. They got a new limited five star character called Blade. And he is a reticent Avenger and a member of the Stellaron Hunters. He possesses an immortal body that keeps healing himself even if he's killed, which is the reason for the numerous bandages on his body. He's a wind type damage dealer and he uses a sharp sword attack to attack enemies and sacrifices his own HP to deal AoE damage. The more damage he takes, the higher damage he deals. And we can't forget the other new limited five star character, Kafka. She's a captivating antagonist who created you as the protagonist in the game. She is enigmatic. Her actions unpredictable and her motives undisclosed. And she uses a katana and some machine guns to attack enemies. After an ally attacks, she will immediately launch a follow up attack, and her ultimate deals lightning damage to all enemies with a chance to inflict enemies with shock. Her abilities and talent trigger the DOT dealt by companions. Now, in version 1.2, the main storyline on the Zionju Lofu reaches its climax. There'll be two new maps, the Alchemy Commission and Scale Gorge Waterscape. And there'll also be interesting limited time events, monsters, and most importantly, the free 10 warps. Log in for seven days to claim 10 Star Rail special passes for free. So make sure to download Honkai Star Rail for free using the link in the description below. And of course, use the redemption code on the screen right now to redeem Stellar Jade times 50. Um... Do you guys really need me here for this? Come on, Sonic. You said you were gonna work the computer for us, right? Yeah, I don't really get along with technology. I had plans with Sonic and Sonic. What about you, Knuckles? You can find a million Master Emerald Shards in Meteor Herd, but you can't work a mouse. Sonic, have you seen my hands lately? All right, fair enough. Let's just get this tier list over and done with. Finally, I'm so ready to talk about Sonic and Knuckles. Aren't we talking about Sonic 3 and Knuckles? That's what I said! Sonic and Knuckles! No, Knuckles! Sonic and Knuckles is one game. Sonic 3 is one game. Together they make Sonic 3 and Knuckles, which is its own full game. So what you're saying is 1 plus 1 equals 1? Sounds like somebody needs a little lesson in math, am I right? What did you just say? They so say sorry I'm the dumb one. Who are you calling not dumb? Definitely not like me. This. I know, Knuckles. Let's just start this list off with Angel Island Act 1. Fine! Since you guys want to rank two games, we can put Angel Island in B tier and move on. What are you talking about? Angel Island Act 1 is a great first level. Sorry, Knuckles, but I agree with Knuckles. Mushroom Hill did it better. Sonic, you're not just going to stand by and let them say this shit, right? Don't look at me. I'm just here to work the computer. I'm not getting involved in any tier list discussions. Okay, but we can all agree Angel Island Act 2 is a masterpiece, though, right? That music is almost as iconic as my raps. Wait, is that the one that rips off Ultimate Flash Sonic? Knuckles, Ultimate Flash Sonic came out in 2004, which is 10 years after 1994. Yeah, like I'm going to take corrections from the math wizard over here. I swear this echidna gets on my last nerve. Sonic, put Act 2 in S tier so we can move on to the next zone. All right, I'm putting Act 2 in S tier and Act 1 in A tier. Now it's time for Hydrocity Zone. Isn't it Hydro City Zone? I literally do not care. I mean, nobody cool actually says Hydro City. I say Hydro City because it's a water city. What is a water city? Doesn't every city have water in it? The zone name is literally two words. Oh, look! Mr. Math wants to school us on numbers again. Please, teacher, tell me where the space is between the letters O and C in the game. I'll show you a space where your front teeth used to be in about two seconds if you don't stop talking to me like that. Guys, chill. All this fighting over a B-tier water level that doesn't even come close to Aquatic Mind. Now hold on, Knuckles. Hydrocity Act 2 is B-tier at best, but Act 1 was a solid S-tier. What? How is Hydro City Act 2 B-tier? That's the best act! I mean, I kept dying on the first part. The wall just closes in on you so fast, and then you gotta spin dash up the incline. Seems like somebody wasn't counting their lives. Look who needs the math lesson now, huh? Actually, I had save states! Bet you feel real stupid right now, huh? Mm. Alright, before Knuckles and Knuckles start boxing, I'm putting Hydrocity Act 1 in A-tier, and Act 2 in S-tier. Way too high if you ask me, but anything to move on from this mess. Speaking of mess, put Marble Garden Zone in D-tier. Isn't that a bit harsh? I think it's B-tier! The environments remind me of Gothic Gardens. Gothic who? It's from Sonic Boom, Fire 
fire and ice? Oh, right, that's your game. Wait, no, it's not. I mean, it sounds like it was you. Just because me and Sonic sound like Sonic and Knuckles from Sonic Boom doesn't mean we are Sonic and Knuckles from Sonic Boom. Yeah, me and Sonic don't even look the same. Fair point, Sonic. But this Knuckles over here is clearly from Sonic Boom. Knuckles spends all his time in the gym, but Knuckles' legs have never touched a leg press machine. And Mr. Math Wiz over here probably can't even count to ten reps. Damn, he got you there. I know you ain't talking, Knuckles. Don't start with me. I used to carry Sonic and Tails on my fists and use them as weapons. And you threw them at rocks, too. Can we just put Marble Garden Zone in C-tier and move on from this? All right, fine, C-tier. And Carnival Night can go there, too. I thought you weren't getting involved in tier list opinions, Sonic. Looks like somebody is a Carnival Night fanboy, huh? Well, some of us can appreciate good level design in a funky environment, S-tier. Please, if I didn't tell you how to get past the barrel, you would have still been stuck on that zone, Knuckles. Well, I got through it in the end, and I realized how fun it was. That's all that matters. C-tier at best. Next! All right, we'll compromise with B-tier. Next is Ice Cap Zone. I think we can all agree that Ice Cap is an S. Yep. Beautiful environments, fun level design. And that Michael Jackson music is oh so special. Dude, I love MJ. I went to his 30th anniversary celebration concert. The one that happened a day before 9-11? Mr. Math, always killing the mood. All right, no need to talk about those... Hard times. Wow. Are you serious? We'll put Ice Cap in S tier and move on to Launch Base Zone. Hmm, I guess that depends on which bosses we're including. Yeah, Act 2 has like three different bosses, depending on which version or character you play. I like Big Arms. It reminds me of me. Of course. Just include whichever boss you like. I think both acts are A tier, but if we're including Big Arms, then I could give Act 2 an S. A tier for Act 1? Dude, did you even listen to that funky music? Everyone knows Act 1 has the better music, but Act 2 is the better level. Besides, the Act 1s always have the better music. Aside from Hydrocity and Angel Island Zone. Exactly! It seems some echidnas have forgotten about Flying Battery Act 2. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. I'm putting Launch Base in A and S tier so we can move on. Oh, wow, we're already done! We're done with Sonic 3, Knuckles. Yes, we're done with Sonic 3 and Knuckles. I'm going to Metburger. Get back here, you idiot! He's gotta be doing this on purpose, right? Alright, time for Mushroom Hill Zone. The superior first level, if you ask me. Damn straight! B tier at best. Here we go. My fellow echidnas just couldn't appreciate the intricacies that Angel Angel Island offered, probably because they forgot what it looked like after abandoning the Master Emerald. What? The Master who? Knuckles thinks he's better than me because he apparently never took his eye off of the Emerald. Which one? I know there's seven, right? Actually, there were seven million emeralds, because irresponsible Knuckles over here let Eggman break the Master Emerald into millions of tiny little pieces. That was that annoying bat's fault. Are you still on this, Knuckles? I guess I just don't know what it's like to be that careless. Come on, guys, stop arguing over useless jewelry. Are, Are you, you fucking, fucking serious, serious, Knuckles? Knuckles? Jeez, Louise, fine. Put Mushroom Hill in S tier, then. All right, swiftly moving on to Flying Battery Zone. Might as well call it Flying Goat Zone, since no other zone is beating this masterpiece. I love a flying goat. That'd be an amazing pet. I mean, Angel Island is clearly superior, but this is a nice zone. A tier. Really? Give me one reason why Flying Battery shouldn't be S tier. I thought the one in Sonic Mania was better. He's not wrong. Well, there'd be no Flying Battery in Mania if it wasn't for the original. And there'd be no Sonic Adventure 2 without Sonic Adventure 1, but SA2 is still the better game. Please, you're just saying that because you weren't in Sonic Adventure 1. Yep. You only got two games! I was in Advance 3, that's three games! Looks like Mr. Math needs to crack open a textbook one of these days, huh? I'll crack open your skull, Knuckles! Alright, let's crack onto the next zone. I'll just put Flying Battery in S tier and move on to Sandopolis Zone. Act 1 is B tier, Act 2 is Trash, E tier. Seems like Knuckles is scared. Woo woo! Shut the fuck up, both of you. Calm down, they're just ghosts. Yes, playing Sandopolis Act 2 gives me King Boom Boo flashbacks. Not my fault I have battle scars unlike you two. Just give him the E tier, Sonic, before Knuckles hides under the table or something. Funny. Alright, fine, moving on to Lava Reef Zone. I think the aesthetics and music carry this zone more than the level design. So? That's the same as Ice Cap, and we still gave that an S. That's true, but if we're including all bosses, then Lava Reef Act 1 can't be higher than A tier. That boss battle is so stupid, what was Eggman thinking? Alright, I'm putting Act 1 in A tier and Act 2 in S tier. Now, do we even include Hidden Palace Zone? I don't like watching Knuckles get fooled by Eggman. Facts! D tier. Alright, it seems Knuckles, Knuckles, and Knuckles are just salty that Knuckles lost the battle to Sonic. Whatever. Nonetheless, we move on to Sky Sanctuary Zone. I have a confession. I like the Sonic version of this level more. How could you say that? Hold up. Let him cook. The Knuckles version may just be a boss, but it's an epic boss with Mecha Sonic. Copium. That's enough, Sonic. If we're being real, the Generations version is better than both. Whoa, Sonic. 
Let's not go too far there. I think A tier is fair for this zone. Sure! The Sonic version holds it back anyway. They're not even supposed to be there. It's a sacred ground. Whatever. So are we finally done now? Yep, we can go now. Let's hit the gym! Wait, what? You guys, we're not done. We've got two more zones left. Knuckles isn't in those zones. So they're irrelevant. Yep. Stop being silly. Knuckles isn't the main focus of the game. If it wasn't for the and Knuckles meme, nobody would even play this game anymore. The Knuckles name carries the game. The true end is when Knuckles ends. All right, I'm putting both Death Egg zone and the Doomsday zone in S tier since you're all being a bunch of salty fucks. Stop rigging our tier list, Sonic. Looks like he's the salty one now. You're gonna get three knuckle sandwiches if you don't rectify that tier list, Sonic. Oh, really? You're getting shift rocked. You knuckleheads put Mushroom Hill over Angel Island. Leave us alone, Sonic. Us? Yeah, this is their tier list, Sonic. We should respect it. Thanks, Sonic. Wait, why the fuck is Marble Garden zone in C tier? You echidnas have no taste. NC Sada ship their rock, rock, punching through a rock, rock, pieces of that rock, rock, gather where we rock, dump, oh, hey, <laughs> NC Sada ship their rock, space trip down the rock, meaty gets me spot, dodging all these rocks, shuffle plus I got, yo, to call, you wanna come out here? Sigging in the spot, cause I get that rock, door is slug, I'm like knock knock, all these dust gon' drop, pop drop, shadow box, yeah, all these dust gon' drop, pop drop, when I box, yeah, all these dust gon' drop, drop, shadow box, hey, woo, woo, hey, hey.